Blessings, welcome to Wallflower Healing. I'd like to thank you for choosing me today. I'm back with a collective what's being hidden from you message. Ah, ah, ah. If you clicked on this video, you're going to watch this message because this applies to everyone. This is not just for one sign. All right, so thank you for choosing me. Let's go into the messages about what is being hidden from you. Please take what resonates and leave what does not. What is being hidden from the collective? Praise, notoriety, what's being hidden from you is an opportunity to excel. Transportation is what I'm hearing. I feel like you won something and somebody didn't tell you you won something. They're holding it back from you. See, at the bottom of the deck, we got the Knight of Pentacles. They're holding this back from you. They're slow to come to come give you your victory. They're discussing it. It's being discussed behind the scenes, but it's not being presented to you. Queen of Wands, what's being hidden from you is that people think she... What's being hidden from some people is a mistress. But I more so feel like You don't know how much people admire you or is attracted to you is what I really get from this. There is some type of protection or like guardian or something around you that keeps you oblivious <laughs> to a lot of things. I'm feeling like somebody's chained because I'm scratching like my neck and my collarbone area. Somebody could have a tattoo like on their collarbone neck area, but like... It's like a shirt. It's like where the tattoo is fit you like a white tee will fit you. But more so, I just feel like somebody is like, I'm feeling a devil card. I feel like what's being hidden is for some of you, somebody has bound you to them. Let's clarify that queen of wands. Seven of wands. I told you you have like a protection over you. Somebody is... I feel like it's a masculine. There's a, a masculine energy that bound himself to a feminine energy. <laughs> like, wants nobody to have access to her. Feel, it's a spiritual marriage. It's like a, a soul tie. Somebody needs to cut a cord if you don't like this. See, yeah, ten of, ten of swords. If you don't like this, you need to cut a cord. What else is being, but I also said there's a mistress and you see what came out is the hierophant, right? So what else is being hidden from the collective? It's masculine energy. <laughs> Three of swords, king of swords, four of cups. What's being hidden is that somebody does not want to tell you the truth about their family situation, about their home. They're juggling in between it. What's being hidden is somebody was, like I said, this is the person that's in the mistress and injury. Somebody was in a third party situation that turned into a four party situation And then the fourth person excused theirself from the situation. And the person who was the ringleader of this third party situation feels like they have no love because everybody is loving themselves now. This person that was the ringleader of this heartbreak, this betrayal, 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 they did they don't love themselves obviously all the the ace of cups that this person possessed was all because of what other people was putting into them but they they're codependent there we go this person has codependent energy if nobody is pouring emotion or in love to them they don't see any value in themselves that's what's being hidden from you what else
four swords. So now this person is trying to find themselves, is trying to telepathically communicate with you. Yeah, wish fulfillment. Somebody's trying to telepathically communicate with you or like see what you're doing, see what you got going on, research. Somebody's trying to research. And I also feel like after hearing this message, somebody's going to try to get rid of this connection that I said that they were bounded to. And it's going to cause this masculine, this three of swords, right? And then he's going to go back. He's going to do it again. <laughs> Am I right? Is he going to do this shit again? Yeah, he is. He's going to do it again. <laughs> he's going to do it again. The seven of swords. He's going to do it again. Because you're his wish fulfillment. Wow. This person don't give a. Wow. Wow. <sighs> what is this person's goal? What is this man's goal? What is this masculine? Because a masculine could be a woman too. It's just the energy you're embodying. What is this person's goal? They want you to change your mind on being their, their feminine. And I said it was a masculine, right? And the Queen of Cups is a feminine energy. They want to change your mind on being their feminine. They want you to go again. They think it's justice. They, they think it's unjust, you see? And it's this King of Swords here. The only strong real masculine this king of swords is like this we need this new beginning i'm going to change your mind wow wow any yeah that's his goal he wants you to be his wife done there's no there's nobody else but him. There's no other options. This person slows down all your options, all your opportunities. It's a red robe. Somebody from your past. Somebody from your past. Somebody that you're not even fully committed to right now, but don't understand why your commitments are not working. See? Ace of Pentacles. <laughs> you don't understand. You need a heal. You need to break this tie here. Judgment. Come on, guys. You need a heal. You got to break this tie. This person was trying to put death to your healing and to your new beginnings. Because the Six of Cups, everybody's like somebody from the past. But the Six of Cups is Scorpio. Scorpio represents death. This person was trying to end your beginning. They were trying to end your... What I tell you. They were trying to end your healing. They didn't want you to have that. All right. That's what's being hidden. I hope I... Per oh. What's the sign? The prominent... Oh, wow. Capricorn. The devil. <laughs> well, there you have it. Collective. Hope this gave you some insight. In the meantime, in between times, sending you nothing but love, peace, and light. Until next time. Blessings.